This is Die Sporting Network. What, what? So when we hit a Pikesville here, Pikesville High School, huge matchup in the Baltimore County Championship scene. And the Division I between Pikesville, Lady Panthers, Newtown, Lady Titans. The winner will receive a berth in all likelihood to the Baltimore County Championship game in two weeks up at Towson University. But also in the MPSSAA 2A situation as well. The winner will all likely host home games against each other probably at some point in doing their playoff situation. Right. Newtown a record of 14 and 3. High school record of 13 and 4. Goes in. The TMV High School Basketball Showcase game. We start. It's going first to Pikesville. Robert Bay, one of the three seniors honored here on Senior Day here today. Back over. Roberts. Fisher. Roberts. Pass it three. Short. Tip the miss. The rebound over to Campbell. She brings it up for Newtown. We've seen the Titans against Mercy up at the Public versus Private Challenge, and we've seen. Pike going a two day span against Polly and against McDonough. Part of that, that one tipped and missed out of bounds, and the Lady Titans will keep it on their end. Good things going. Airs will inbound. Scoreless here so far in the first 30 seconds in this one. Swings it. Turned it over. Back comes Robertson, gives it up to Robertson. Oh, tried to look inside in a turnover, and the ball will go back to the Lady Titans. Kind of rivalry here. Under the legs. Back over inside, missed it high there was Ayers. Back comes Bay. Bay up the court. Sterling scores. 
Hawks to start it off for the Lady Panthers, the defending 1A champions, even though this year they're in 2A. Looking for that crowd. Double. Back over to Man. Swings it. Burton. Then over to Campbell. 2-0 lead here for Pikesville again the winner. All right, the hood to see Western Tech in the Baltimore County Championship game on February 25th up Towson. Shot clock down to two. That one tipped and missed. Back over to Roberts. And he lost it. And then it went out. And it's staying with Pikesville because Newtown couldn't pick it up. Early affair here between these two. Trying to settle in here. Again to the Lady Titans, our only 2 nothing lead here for Pikesville so far. Legs there, back over. Long pass, and it's going out of bounds. Turnover. Ball back to Pikesville again. 5.49, he left in the first. Robinson. Turner. Over again. Inside, Sterling got tapped. It's staying with the Lady Panthers again. 5.29, he left in the first quarter. High school guys on showcase matchup. Again, stakes in the MPSSA, stakes in the Baltimore County Championship race. Jumper, no good. Did not go up high enough for Robert. Back is Burton. Got tapped, staying with Newtown. First time, like I said, we've seen the Lady Titans since the game against Mercer. County Championship situation here. Back, swings it again. That's a three. That hits there for Ayers, and Newtown takes a one point lead. Three to two. Hey, she tried to swing it, almost got turned over, but Heisberg will keep it here on their end. Two. Yep, well, they said it was on the floor. Fisher. It could have been a either way there. That's the first team foul on either side. And this first one on Newtown. Makes it Sterling. Pulls up at the line. That spinned out. Offensive rebound there to Roberts. And it's going back to Newtown. The defense has been put on in this one so far. Between these two girls' teams. It's a one point lead here. So much at stake in this one. This is one of Baltimore County. And a travel. Pikesville gets it back. That's a three. That one no good. Almost had the rebound. Newtown will get it back again. Or will it? Nope. It will stay with Isa. It was tapped by one of the Newtown players. And Robinson gets it. Floor again, second team foul against Newtown. Hey, hey, 22! 22! Watch the middle. Key matchup. Here's the 2A side, MP 
the SSA. Bay swings it over. That's a drive. Robinson pulls up and hits. 4 3 game for Pikesville. Shooting two. at the line shooting the pair trying to regain the lead here for the Lady Titans first shot in there Way to get a three point play. A timeout by Pikeville. 6 4 lead here for the Lady Titans. And again, the winner of this matchup, and size again, will in all likelihood be in the Baltimore County Championship game to join Western Tech. Western Tech beat Catonsville back in January to punch their ticket on the Division II side. And also is huge because the winner is matchup with these two teams meet in the MPSSA playoff sectionals. In all likelihood, it will go to Newtown of having the home field advantage or Pikes field, the winner of this game. So, so much at stake here, not just because of the county situation, but also in the states as well. This playoff pushes here. I said the game plan is also showcases we still have regular season games, but I. We come to you taking on a Sunday. It's going to be from a championship situation. That is another foul against Newtown. That's their third so far. Robinson went down for Pikesville. Down two. Open bay for three. Tipped and missed. Robinson tried to fight for it, and she stepped out trying to get it. Then the ball goes back to the Lady Titans. Back over. Doubles in the corner. Timeout by Newtown. Go over to this scoreboard. So close to both. And we thank you so much for joining us here on the Dive Sporting Network. Check us out on Instagram and Twitter at Dive Sporting Network. As always, check us out on our official Facebook page, Dive Sporting Network. And finally, 940 plus subscribers strong. We thank you so much for that on the membership here on YouTube. So much action. Girls, I just want to add to this. Including Riverdale Baptist. Polly has done magnificently well. Of course, St. Francis girls. Defense Milani. Pikesville here at Newtown as well. Donna, Roland Park Country, as the IAM playoffs begin tomorrow on the Division A side. Division B already begun. Give you some updates of that on our coverage. That's that one slips out of bounds. Turn over there, back to Pikeville. Going to D, C, I, A, A. Championship and then the next day after Matthew with we'll good counsel. Let you know what happened with that and my media partners, the covenant, we'll let you know about it. Inside, Roberts, and one, count the basket. Shooting the and one here, we're tied at six. Here in this one. The and one goes, one point lead for the purple of the Panthers. There. Three quarter here, two thirty seven here left. Drive here. Contact Campbell is coming to shoot two. First shot, no 
good off the bat. Second time, Newtown missed some free throws and gotten the possession back. They scored the last time. Let's see if they can do it again. Almost turned over. They had the hands. Just couldn't get down. a two-point lead for the Lady Titans. Fakes it. Nice pass. Bay. That went wild. Offensive rebound to Roberts didn't go. Roberts trying to put it back up. They call a jump ball. And I think Pikeville should, should keep it. Yeah, on this possession, they will. They will. Point game. Sterling. Roberts from deep. Check the net. Sterling with the rebound. She's got to get it out of there and, and she traveled because of it. Good defense by Newtown. They boxed her in and she couldn't go anywhere. 146 left in the first. Almost stolen and it is. Roberts. And it didn't go. Pick City. He was looking for more. 90 seconds they left in the first. It's a drive. Inside off the glass and airs back at the line to shoot two more. Some hands, some hands. Onto the He's modest over here, talking to the voice of uh, Baltimore County Sports over here, Tim Tootin, the junior that is. By the way, son of Tim Tootin Senior. Getting ready for the Baltimore County Championship game. You can check that out on, if you're in Baltimore County, it's at Channel 75, right? Channel 75 in Baltimore County. The Baltimore County Championship will be there. They can thank me later for a free play. That's a long distance shot, no good. Or, right now, Newtown has challenged Pikesville and they've been able to make this their type of game so far, but we got a long ways to go. Burton gives it up and a travel. The walk there. Walk there by Jumbo, I believe. Down the stretch here in the first quarter. Roberts up and in. We got a two point game here. Jumper, no good. The rebound over to Moore. Gives it up now to Glover Bay. Glover Bay back. That swings. Sterling from deep. Tipped and miss. Nice rebound there by Mann. And we can, uh, can uh, increase their lead as the first quarter comes to a close. That's a three. That one no good by Ayers. Five. And a reach in foul. 4.2 left. That's the 15th foul already against Newtown. Free throw, Over the inbound. Talk to both coach and staff to know the importance of this game here today, not just in the county transfer situation, but in the states as well. Sterling got it. That's the right one. You want to have it. It will count if it goes, and it does there by Roberts. We're tied at 11 after one here, Pikeville. And 
Well, we ain't bragging, but the last couple of weeks has been close action in the Dodge Network, and I think we're gonna have another one. And we'll be back after this break. Second quarter here underway, we are dead even at 11. In this crucial Division I matchup here in the girls' side of Baltimore County. Newtown, Pikesville, who's going to be repping Division I in the county championship game? What a three by Campbell. I'll tell you, Newtown got the outside shot going so far here. With a couple of them. Drive back over. been very well in the paint so far in this one. She's been positioning very well. Senior day for her. Two other seniors. Yeah, the defending championship team of Pikesville. They won the county last year. They won 1A last year. Even though they moved up to 2A this year. Moore couldn't stand to finish that. Over here, we got a one-point game. New town up. Man, back to Ayers. Ayers looking to go all the way to the basket and off the glass. That's indeed a three-point lead here. Iverson, it back. Offensive foul. 14 foul against the Lady Panthers. That's some girls action in the DCIA championship game next week. Girls, that boy side, and then the WCAT semifinals. Out of bounds, turnover. And Pikesville gets it back. Our girls action coming. Going to be coming at you as well with uh, one of the girls MPSSA matchups. And we'll be playing to be at States as well. Friday with action. Probably at 1A and 2A. We're seeing Pikesville. All right to hook. Roberts tried to get it and it got turned over. Pick City by Bay. Layup. Miss Wise. She got it back. Puts it back up. With no avail there. Back to Ayers of Newtown. Fakes. Jack temporarily drive on the baseline. It Miss Wide back over the man. Man gets it back off the glass. It goes in. Biggest lead here for the Lady Titans at five. 18-13. Second chance. And the reward is in for Parker. Parker the freshman. Look at that too. Three ball. No good. Man got it back. She had to tap it. Bad part is nobody was there waiting for it. And it goes back to Pikesville. 57 left here in the first half. Trying to get it up. And Pikeville got a break there as Ayers trying to hang on to the ball. It went out of bounds right on the baseline. 41 left. Ramos back. 
under the legs. Sterling though, and she's coming to shoot a pair. 16 foul against Newton. First shot. Off the back. Flex on getting your sports high. You want it when you need it. That's what we're talking about. NBA All Star game. Now we're stopped. The flex on coming at you. Flex on the links. Under each of the five videos. Two point lead here for Newtown. Yes. Campbell. The ball now. Newtown right now only running seven. Wise timeout by. Point lead, respect the number. Close one in the game again. Where so much is at stake on both ends. And like I said, the state players, any advantage, trust me, will help you a bit in that. Can't wait for that. Coming up, big one in Baltimore County, Wednesday, the boys' side team, Woodlawn and Delaney. It's Delaney's senior day. Woodlawn and all I've done to the Baltimore County Township, and Delaney losing the new time. If I feel, excuse me, Parkville somehow. And beat Newtown coming up here on the boys' side. A good three way time. Needs to open things up for Delaney. The regular season ends on the 24th of February, and then you go right into the championship game, and then a couple days later, you get ready for the playoffs and stuff. It'll be interesting to see how that goes. Pikesville, Parkville, excuse me, has had a magnificent year. Uh, Baltimore County, the only beat was to Delaney. A ball for half a row. And they were hoping to get see all our buddies there in the state playoffs coming up on you know, the nine playing network. And this could be the first full year we'll be bringing you a piece of all three days from somewhere. Plan to be 3A and 4A on the boys' side on day one, and then 1A and 2A on the girls' end, and then we'll be bringing you the boys' championship. Personally, back to four. Okay. Sterling inside. And the foul is called against Pikesville. That's their 15. And 29 left in the first half. Interesting matchup here. Give it up there to Turner. They get it back there. Campbell, shot clock at seven. Got to do something. Inside, Ayers puts it up. And it goes in. Four. Point lead up to six now, 22-16. Newtown's done a good job of frustrating Pike on the offensive end here. Robinson. And again, a turnover. Man with pass to recipients. Over to Campbell now. Man. For three. Tip the mess. Offensive rebound over the airs. Fresh shot clock. Campbell looking to mix it up. 239 here left in the first half. Yes, inside. Back. Three ball, no good. Smashes. Roberts back to Robinson. Robinson. And a foul. That's a 17 foul. That equals the one on Shot here for Robertson. Got it. Yeah. 
Now it's the lead to four. The 224, I It's a jump ball on the deck. It's pointing Pikesville's way. And it is going back to the Lady Panthers. 2-8 left. In the first half. Contact there. Let it go. Campbell. Newtown's done a good job of keeping Pikes Grove in their pace. 16 foul against the Lady Panthers there. Shot clock ain't clocked by the 10 second difference. Bay almost had it, but it's staying with Newtown. They get both on right now. Get it back over! Got it! And one for Robert! <laughs> Robert's play has been huge in his first hand. It's a one-point game as halftime is knocking on the door. Nine, eight, seven, six. Airs to the ten. No good. Robertson lost it. At the buzzer. No good. So at halftime, well, like I said earlier, another close one here on the end. Getting the stakes so high in this one. We'll be back with the second half after the BWG. We'll tell you what they're about in the fruit commercial break. Newtown, up one. You're at the break.
second half here underway. The monster out here with you. The guys do that showcase. Damn! That's a basket. As Pikesville starts second half off with the lead back. Again, with another key possession there. Two point late here for the Lady Panthers. And a foul. Oh, a travel. Newtown gets it back. Try to retake the lead here. Left in the third. Turner. Over to Campbell. Gonna swing it back. Looking to fake inside. Shot clock down to 10. Man swings it. Man inside off the glass and in. We're tied at 20. Wide there. Or more, excuse me. Ah, Sterling couldn't get it in. Here it comes. Town. Long distance two. Tip the miss there by Turner. Rebound over to Moore. Inside Roberts. Barbecue chicken and one. <laughs> She's rolling. in the third. Almost tapped. Shot clock down to 12. Over to Campbell. Oh, and turned it over. How about Bay with the steal? Whoa, look out. Fucking foul. No offensive foul. Whoa, the other way. Big time. Oh, wow. I don't know. It could have been a bang bang call right there. They both was moving. That, that was close. That was close. That, that was a difference. I, I, I will say that. Sending the elbow there probably was a difference in that foul call. Here springs it up. Inside. Over and in. Campbell cuts the lead to three. <laughs> Drive from Robinson, the floater. Tip the miss. Ayers rushing in to get that one. Newtown, Pikesville. One out of here. Open. 
open jumper. That tips off the back for Campbell. Offensive rebound there. That's a three. Hits it. We are tied at 33. Ayers strikes again.
well. Roberts trying to fight for that rebound. Up in the air. Turned it over there as Ayers was able to keep it somehow. That was huge there for Newtown. Ayers got it now. seating purposes for good counsel in that game. The Mavs are trying to look to be undefeated in the WCAC and then we need the semifinals and finals of WCAC. Finals here on the dice line. Pikesville at home this fourth quarter. 
Another good one. Coming at you in the dice on that one. The DFB High School Basketball Showcase. We will be back. here on the way here. That That three hit from Ann. Takes the lead back by two. Whoa, look out. Oh, that's not good for Bay. Bay went down on her knee. Oh, damn. The time out goodness this she is up. She's going to have to come out here for a brief moment. This foul on the inbound. Well down. It's all right. It's all right. Moore's coming in, so we're going to get things back on track. Again, the ball goes back to Pikesville. Down two now from that three. For man here. What a back and forth. Brings it back to Sterling. Back up, back up, back up. Swing it again. Sterling for three. Hits it. Lee back to Pikeville by one. The lead changes has been crucial here in the second half. to three. The ball will stay. Two-point lead here for Newton. At the seven-minute mark, anybody's game still. Baltimore County Championship berth on the line. MPSSA two A seating on the line. Pike fell down too. Trying to retake the lead. Ray, back to Robinson, Sterling. Did a big shot there on the last possession. Back to Bay. Robinson pulls up at the line. Archie's shot goes in again. This time from the two point variety. And it's a tight game. At 43. There's several lead changes here in the second half on both ends. Fakes it, man. Drives to the hoop. And the tie is unbroken again. Okay. Chat. Back to Sterling. Over to Robinson. 
Johnson. Back to Sterling, open. Fakes it. Back over to Fisher. Shot clock down. Robinson again hits. Oh, not for the singer. Me to one and for Pikeville. Punch time here in this fourth. Campbell inside. And she's shooting two. 13 foul against Pikeville. in this one. Roberts, she will be getting a one. 22 points. I'm trying to add one more to that total. That's it. One point lead for Pikesville, timeout. Lady Panthers. Oh my. Well, this is early, another close one here. <laughs> that was been a trend here the last month. We had a matchup that you for the states. It's not there. Man, it's been a minute. I shouldn't say since the turn of the year, the games have been tight, close. Set watches going on. Got some matches up at uh, Morgan. That sounded so wasn't in doubt. Since then, this is the time. Burden back in. She has four fouls right now for Newtown. And it's key. Offensively, I think it's key for Newtown. Back, man, almost turned it over. She gets it back still. Shot clock down to 12. Campbell. Boxing one, batted, out of bounds, 
Newtown keeps it with four seconds left on the shot clock. That's the shoot situation here. Second call. And Pikeville gets it back. Newtown might not want to take one of the timeouts. Good defense there by the Lady Panthers. Sterling puts it up. High off the glass. No good. Sterling got it back. Off of four Titans was under there. Shot clock down to 13. Did not reset the ball did not hit the rim. Robinson in the corner. No good offensive rebound goes in to Moore. We got a three point game here. 3.30 left. Baltimore County, title spot on the line. MPSSA 2 a team on the line. Out of bounds, it stays with Newtown. As Campbell got it tapped out. Six left, three point lead here for Mike. For shot. And Offensive rebound to Sterling. That was huge. Ball on the deck again. Newtown tried to get it back and could not. Bay and the shot clock. 18 for Michael. Three ball, no good. Tipped out of bounds. Newtown gets it back. Down by two deceptions. Two forty six left. Boys and girls action, and then good council to Matha, you know, the 
And that would be in VIC National Showcase game on President's Day. If Samantha stays undefeated, we will see. We got a tough game against Paul the Sixth the night before. Really good counsel. Less than 24 hours after that. Half for you here in the National Network. Men. Then the WCAC. Games for you here on the dice right now. Back here, the game action, New Town. Some points generated and quickly. Harris with it. She does it. Air drives to the basket. And if she walks, oh, she's been giving up. She did not. Crucial. Sterling with it. Sterling inside. And that might be the dagger. Championship game! Two shots coming up here for Campbell. 104 left. Crucial free throws here for Newtown. to tap it back and gets it Sterling's. Time out by Pikesville. 50.4 left. 58-48. To calm them down. No doubt. No doubt about that. Definitely have to calm them down there. This is the Baltimore County Championship game on February 25th. We'll be at the Baltimore City Championship game. Really rare that both of them is on the same night. Usually the city one a couple of days beforehand, but they set up this year, and I think a couple matches with Lake Clifton has several regular season matchups still. They have to get through. So that has to take place. Weston and Holly the girls' side, and they clip in Holly the boys. And we have it. We have the DC IA Championship game Sunday. Taping Sunday will be on Monday, on President's Day. I have a day back. That's the plan anyway. Robinson over the bay. Foul. I'm gonna have to foul. Too much time taken off. Sterling got it. Didn't. Shot clock violation, but it did the job for what Pikesville needed to do. Shot clock, game clock. Uh, less than a three second difference. Inside, man. Yes, that is no good. On the deck. Newtown gets the bounce, shot clock is off. I said at the time, not on their side. Jumper, no good. Foul is called. Shooting a one and one here. 16.2 left. Newtown. 
one line and got to hit them both. I'm making it eight. Right. The second to go, timeout by Newtown. 58 50 lead. And again, the time is. Not on the side here. Smith, Avenue, Capital with the DCIA championships and the math and the council next week. Again, the last number till then. Say so long to you. See you down the road.
This is Guy Sporting Network. What, what? This is Guy Sporting Network. What, what, what?